next, it's a welterweight showcase between Nate Diaz and Rick Story. Rick Story, coming off a great training camp. He's ready to put on a show. The pride of Stockton, California. Ultimate Fighter winner, Nate Diaz. He won the lightweight Ultimate Fighter crown back at season five. His head coach was former champion, Jens Pulver. Our tale of the take for this welterweight bat. Story is one year his elder, Diaz, will have a five inch reach advantage. Nate Diaz. You ready? Rick you ready? Story. And here we go. It's the Southpaw versus the Southpaw. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Story. Black trunks for Diaz. Rick Story has a very aggressive style and basically does the same thing in every fight. Closes the distance, gets a fighter up against the cage, and tries to smash him. He clipped him with that one. Head kick. Wow, what a great job mixing things up. Good leg kick by Nate. Nicely done, he slipped the punch. Trying to go to the body. Good pro fighters always move well side to side. He lands a head kick. Story with the takedown, nicely done. That's it! Oh, it is, is all over. over! Rick the Horror Story! Wow. Unbelievable! Tremendous TKO. Great stoppage by the referee. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest at 1 minute 44 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO! Rick the Horror Story! Rick Story wins tonight by TKO. Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Frank Mir and Matt Mitrio. Frank Mir. You ready? Matt Mitrio. Ready? And here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Mitrio. Black trunks for Mir. Frank Mir is one of those fighters who has a true belief in Brazilian jiu-jitsu. And he has proven if he can get his opponent in a position to submit him, nine out of ten times the fight's over. Yeah, his jiu-jitsu is very solid, Mike. Having submitted such big guys as Tim Sylvia and Brock Lesnar, very dangerous with all types of submissions. Ah, Joe, we can see the game plan. Punish his opponent's leg. Yeah, no doubt about that one. Man, he's showcasing some great kicks. Big leg kick lands. Oh, oh solid man. jam. Oh, huge kicks. Oh, that's a big leg kick. Oh, what an exchange. Oh, that hook did damage. Three minutes. Oh, that right hand hurt. Big combination. Swing and a miss. Rocked him with that right hand. Lands a nice kick. Wow, he goes down. 
right hand. Right hand. Right hand. All oh, over him on the ground. He's oh! It is all oh. over! Wow. Just like that! Wow. Wow! Brutal ground and pound for the KO. Time now for our fight replay. And let's look at the replay and see the end of this fight. This is the huge ground and pound strike that led... With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Lugliotta is going to stop for this contest at three minutes, seven seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by... Mitrion, winner by knockout. Coming up next, it's a lightweight bout between Rafael Dos Anjos and Habib Nurmagomedov. For this lightweight championship fight, Nurmagomedov is 27. Dos Anjos is 31. The rep. Rafael Dos Anjos. Habib Nurmagomedov. Here we go. Tonight's main event of the evening is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Nurmagomedov. Black trunks for the champion. One thing to look out for in this fight is Rafael Dos Anjos' use of the elbow. He has excellent elbow strike technique. Caught him with the right. Nice sweep. Oh, he's got oh, his guy's got back. Half guard here. He's keeping busy from the bottom. for an arm bar here. Look at this. Almost had the arm bar. He's got his back here, Joe. Numergo Medov's got the full mount again. Hip escape, nice hip escape. Into side control. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Good transition in the half guard. He's got the full mount, Joe. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. He's on top again. It looks like he's trying to set up an arm bar here. He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. And he's out. Remember, Gomedov's going for a submission. And he got out of the arm bar. Hip escape. And he's out of the full mount. Nicely done. Goes Andros with good connection from the bottom. Nope, lost it. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mount. He's in guard here. We are back in the half guard again. Kick. Oh, did he snap that kick? This is shot to the body. He connects again. Good jab by Nurmagomedov. Meadow. Oh, he got clipped. Nice strike slam. Drops down for a double. Big takedown there. Nicely done. First round in the books. And here we see some beautiful submission offense here. Here's an incredible highlights in that. Ready, fight. Ready. Set for round two. 
lightweight title fight. We continue this championship battle, and the top contender continues to display his overall improvement. He has worked his whole life for tonight's opportunity, and so far, he's really taken it to the champ. And there he swung with a haymaker. Clean. Here. Vicious knee to the body. Oh, he's landing at will. Big straight punch. Back and forth battle. I like that, Mike. I like how he's mixing it up. Damaging leg kick. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Hurt him with that right. That's a hard with that hook. hook. Head kick. Combination. for the triangle, grabs his ankle, pulls down on his shin. Under two. He got out of the triangle. Nice body shot. Here we go, Medoff, caught by that head kick. Both men landing in that exchange. That's Huge a beautiful hook. hook. Vicious combinations. That's a big hook. How good is this? Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Kill oh, slam. slam. Great movement on the ground. His left eye is really starting to swell here. And he's got his back here. 15 seconds left in the round. Flying in. The knee. Joe, nice knee to the body by Numero Gometa. Gonna head to round three. Here we see, we really got a chance to see some Start of the third round of this championship fight. Joe, that was a good round we just saw. It'll be very interesting to see if the fighters can keep this pace. I think they will keep this pace. I think they're actually going to probably start turning it up a notch as we head down the home stretch. He's posturing up here. Let's see if he can pass that half guard. He side got control. it. Very nice. Moved into side control. Kimura. And he escaped the Kimura. Half guard. He's going for his arm here. Now he's going to the arm bar. That was a deep arm bar. And he's got it in guard. Knee to the body by the champ. Really missed with that right hand. Numer go met off with a nice jab. He scores with the leg kick. Look at that. He's doing some damage with those kicks. Nice shot. Oh! And a good takedown by Dos Anjos. Nice. Big right hand. Able to pass to half guard. 
Oh, he sweeps. Look at his position now. Side control. Nicely done. Transitions to the arm bar. And he gets out of it. Deep arm bar. Beautiful escape. Looking for a triangle. Throws one leg over the shoulder. He's got the leg over the shoulder. Now he's going to pull down on his shin. He adjusts to the arm bar. Throws him over on his back. He may have to tap in. Outstanding. Hit all over. Beautiful technique in winning this fight by arm bar. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And we see here, as soon as this arm bar gets locked in, there is no escape. Perfect technique, tremendous pressure. And here, it Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 46 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by submission, due to an arm bar, Nurmagomedov is the new UFC lightweight champion. And what an exciting card tonight. For my partner, Joe Rogan, this is Mike Goldberg saying so long until we see you next time inside the Octagon.